This is CNN Breaking News. Welcome to the lead. I'm Jake Tapper. We begin with breaking news in our money lead. A huge loss on Wall Street today. The Dow closing in just a moment down. You hear the bell there. Down around 750 points amid an escalation in the U.S. China trade war. CNN's Allison Kozak is at the New York Stock Exchange. Allison, why? What exactly prompted this big drop? Because of an escalation in this tit for tat trade war. That's why we saw these massive losses in the stock market. Overnight, the latest salvo coming from China, devaluing the yuan, its currency, against the dollar. Uh, there also now is a worry that there could be a global currency war on top of the trade war. Now, China is saying that this wasn't a deliberate move, but many believe it is in retaliation for President Trump promising to slap a 10 percent tariff on the final $300 billion in Chinese goods. That tariff going into effect on September 1st. It's something that White House advisors had tried to get the president not to do because especially of that timing, Jake. It's supposed to go into effect once again on September 1st. That's right in the middle of back to school shopping. So that could hit American consumers really hard because that tariff will hit those consumer products and clothing. And American companies are caught right in the middle, Jake. Allison, how long, how much longer should we expect to see this market volatility? And that's why you're seeing this kind of move today, uh, especially with the Dow down over 700 points, because there is no end in sight. Uh, Treasury Secretary Steve Mnuchin had promised that there could be a solution to this deal by the end of the summer. Well, that looks highly unlikely, and now investors are thinking there's probably not going to be a solution to the trade deal this year. So that puts a lot in question, and that increases the volatility. So you're seeing investors reprice stocks because they're expecting corporate America to get hit hard. Jake. Allison Kozak at the New York Stock Exchange. Thank you so much.